All right, so inside Game Launcher Creator V2, you can also insert the web view object. So this enables you to display a website or a web page directly inside your launcher. And as you can see, you can move it about and you'll be able to resize it as well. You can't resize it inside the editor, uh, but you can resize it uh, by going to the object inspector and right clicking and object properties. So what you can do in here is, for example, you can, I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm just going to delete this background image for a second. So I'm just going to position this in the top corner. So again, I can get the object properties through here uh, and I can set the X and the Y coordinate to zero, zero. And I'm going to set it to the width and the height of the game launcher, which is 1280 by 720. I click apply and you can see it's now like a full screen web browser. Uh, so I can simply paste in a URL up here, so any website, and click apply, and you'll notice that it loads the website up. So again, there's not many uh, other options that come with WebView, but then again, there isn't really many other options that you need. And you can see that you can allow your user to browse a website or a forum or anything like that in directly inside uh, your game launchers. So it's absolutely perfect for displaying websites and web pages. Um, there is a couple of things uh, with regards to the web view object. For example, it will always be on the top layer. You can't layer the web view object. And the reason behind that is, is because it's a Windows control. Uh, so all window controls are always drawn to the top. So you can't layer the web view object, um, but obviously you can position and size it to fit in your launcher window exactly where you need it. Uh, but again, there's nothing really much more for me to cover on that, except um, how easy it is to just pop in your website URL uh, and it will load it up uh, for your users to see inside the game launcher.